Okay. So I'm gonna just use a dry sheet of paper. Okay. I'm gonna mix some colors. Green and blue and I like the colors before they're totally mixed when you can see both colors. Uh, when I'm mixing them in here, you mean? Yeah. Over to you. Yeah, so um, I, uh, so you're talking about when I right do there. that. Yeah. Right there. So I'm going to try to just take some of that and it doesn't keep the other color there. A little bit there, there's some green in that. Yeah, oops, I'll notice that. I'm gonna put some blue in there. I just like watching it, it's like swirling the colors together. Yeah, well there you can see the different colors coming out there too. Gonna put some yellow thingies in there. And a little bit of water there and put some purple in there. I don't like that. And do some yellow. And uh, I want a sky this time. It really looks like a sky too, the way it's mixed with gray and white. Yeah. And it's pulling up some of that green there too. I'm gonna get some uh, dark blackish color with the, the brown and the blue. That's really black. That is. That's as black as it gets. Good black. Mm -hmm. Still bleeding. Look at the bleeding up in there too. Yeah. So there's the, uh, I want to put some red in there. A little short on the red here. Hmm. So, color set. This is, um, it's um, cadmium red light. I'll put it in where there's white. Just get some hidden by the other colors. A little bit of a darker red inside of it. I'm going to stop because I feel like it's getting sort of muddy. And um, mm -hmm. I'm going to wait to blow it, blow on it because it's really wet. It looks like a boy carrying a canoe and there's a squirrel sitting on top of it behind him. 
Where's the boy? Right in the middle. There's a boy. This, yeah. This That's figure his here. His arm and his legs down the bottom. Yeah. He's carrying the canoe. Yeah. And there's a squirrel right behind him on top of the canoe. Squirrel or a cat. Yeah. Trying to get this blue spot out. Good enough. I'm going to blow on it now, Catherine. See what happens. Oh, I like that. remember to say something. All right. Blow this top down, Catherine. Mm -hmm. See what it did right there? Oh, yeah. I didn't see that before. I just blew it down. I'm going to set that up there. And uh, turn this around. Hmm. Right, so, it, so you can see it better. Uh -huh. yeah. You see that all right? Yeah, very good. I like the way that top dripped down. I didn't see it that well before. Oh, yeah, that's what I was pointing out right there. Yeah, I like that. You can see it's still wet. Yeah. So it's... I really like the way the sky is. Uh huh. Now the boy has something else in his hand. Looks like something round. Uh -huh. You mean right in there? No, in his hand, which is down at towards the bottom of the boat. The canoe. Is this the canoe? Yeah. And the boy's in the middle. And his body goes straight through the canoe. Uh -huh. 
That's his foot that you're pointing to. That's his um, foot. Where's his head? Is this his head right here? That's his hair. Oh, so this is his head. Yeah. I see. Is that like an eye? No, no. He's got just a tiny little nose and mouth. Over in here? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Because he's facing to the right. Yeah. I see him now. He's just walking along, carrying the boat. Uh -huh. I, I see him a lot clearer now. I just found another person. And he or she is like laying vertical, laying horizontally at the bottom, really big from one end to the other. The head oh. is on the left. Looks is like a the, woman. Is that the head? Yeah. And what did you say? It looks, like, looks like what kind of woman? Oh, uh, she has a bun. The black part is her uh, bun. Right here. Uh, yeah. Is that her nose? Is that her nose and eye? No, that's her hair. Her nose is down below that. Down there. That, that's the nose, and there's an eye right there, by the nose. Right here. Just above the nose. Yeah. Right there. Up, right here. No, no, no. Go back to the nose. That's the nose, and the eye is right next to it, it's on the edge. No. Down there now. <laughs> I need my pointer. <laughs> nose. It's just a slight white spot. Right above here. My nose. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I keep trying to point with my uh, arrow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Can you put your uh, turn your video on? Oh. It's still on. I just see your photograph. Oh, okay. <clears throat> there. That's better. Yeah. It's hard for me to hold my phone in without it jumping around like it's doing. Yeah. What are you holding now? I'm holding my phone. Because uh, I don't have it. I don't have it. I don't have it in the holder. I should. That. Yeah, that's got to be hard to do. Let me put it in the phone. And then I'll move this over here. Oops. Good. <clears throat> there you go. That's easier. That works. Yeah. So now I don't have to hold anything. Yeah. Right. Oh, so this woman, you know, I showed you her head. Her body, yeah. her body goes all the way down to the end of the picture, right where your pen is. That's her yeah. feet, I guess. So what are these things in here as it's, parts of her body? Just, it's just um, her body. Okay. There's nothing specific. Yeah. I see an arm going down, shoulder and an arm going down. <clears throat> That's all I see that's recognizable. Uh -huh. <clears throat> this looks like a, a face, a head up here. And this looks like something that's 
like a bug that's on the guy's nose. Yeah. <laughs> Remember what this was like before I put all these red things in? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think I, uh, I don't know. I love the sky. Yeah. That's when you added the red. You wanted to add red. Yeah. Where you got all those figures. These two figures here look like they're face to face. See the eye mm -hmm. of this figure. Yeah. There's a mouth of this figure and an eye and nose. Yeah. And they're kind of, their faces are close together. Mm-hmm. Right at the middle of the picture. Yeah. Remember when I used to draw the eyes and then mouth in? Yeah. And that, that really made it a lot more dramatic, didn't it? it made it, um, well, it made it so that other people couldn't see different things in it. So it, I don't think yeah. so. I mean, I thought it added some humor. Yeah, it, it did. And we, you're thinking that then if you have the face, then they can't see any other figure in there. Yeah. <clears throat> I wanted to leave it open-ended. I never really thought about that. I'll have to go back at some of the ones that you did faces and see what I'm thinking about. Uh -huh. Whether I see other things. Yeah, I think it, uh, I think it really uh, defines it in a way that it inhibits other people's imagination. Because <clears throat> I'm using my imagination to look for faces and then I make a face with eyes and a mouth mm -hmm. and then nobody else can see it that differently. Because it's too defined by my eyes and mouth that I've drawn in. And, and I've been trying to leave the, make the title so it's not so definitive either. I think that if um, you're working with kids, that they would enjoy having the faces on it. Or yeah, they would. Trying to, doing it themselves. Yeah. yeah. Well, when I've worked with the fourth graders and fifth graders at Bowdoin Central, um, I did show them my paintings with the faces on them. And then when they did a painting themselves, and they put their own faces on their painting. Yeah. So they were able to, you know, do that same process. And it wasn't, yeah. what I did was really a model for what they could do. Yeah, that, that was the best thing. That's really, really good. Yeah.
Okay, Catherine, I'm going to stop.